Hello, hello, y'all, y'all, y'all. Listen, I promised this year we was going to get more into lifestyle content. And these are the kind of things I like. Let me start off by saying, don't let nobody channel you or put you into a box. I'm a very diverse person who love different things. I love wine. I love coffee. I love, love, love candles. I'm a sneaker lover, along with being frugal and on the beauty side of things. So I'm not one noted, right? I had somebody tell me, well then your channel will be all over the place. I mean, I feel like she was all over the place, but I didn't judge. So being on my bougie girl swag, y'all, nothing warms my heart like some good wine and a candle. So I'm doing this video because I need y'all to trust me. I need y'all to trust me moving forward. I have so many different brands of candles from $5 to $300 and I want to start reviewing them with y'all because the candle community is big and if you don't know about candles maybe you will get into candles right? So everybody knows by now the cult classic favorites any candle by Bath and Body Works. Why these are so popular? Well the size candle you get, you get 14.5 ounce. It's a three wick candle. They have single wicks but I tend to stay away from those. I tend to do the three wick. Um, they recently had a price increase. So $24.50 for a candle and if you catch the $10 off a of three wick you're going to pay $14.50. Still not bad in my opinion because I would pair two of these together with something else. Hit the $30 threshold, take $10 off of that. You always have coupons in your app if you don't get the ones in the mail and make it do what it do. Or annual candle day, always the first Saturday in December and you rack up. Bath and Body Candles are made with essential oils. So let me help y'all to the T because you know... Sometimes black community, we be last to get on things. And let me tell y'all a little something about essential oils and the candles. You could burn your oil. I hear people say, I leave my candle burning from sun up to sun down. Mm -mm. Your candle specifically tells you four hours. And when I go to unlit my candle, I don't do this. I just smother it back, okay? And you also want to trim your wicks. Make for a good throw. Throw me in the scent, how it throws across the room. When somebody says it smells good on coal, it's not lit. So when you're in the store, you're smelling candles on coal, which brings me to what I wanted. So, white gardenia, right? One of my favorites from Bath and Body Works has a heavy throw. I have a two bedroom, two bath apartment. I don't want to light three, four candles at one time. That's just not my thing. That's not how you save money. That's just that just don't even make sense. Y'all, I stumbled upon something the other day. So by the way, Wine of the Night, this is a blush by Yellowtail. Not too expensive, um, but cheap enough to drink, cheap enough to cook with. It's dry, it's white, it's a rosé, but it's not a fuzzy rosé, and I like it, y'all. So, went into Aldi's. The brand is called Huntington Homes. And apparently, everybody knows about these candles. I'm in a lot of candle groups and they know about them. I just didn't know, right? So you have a 14.5 ounce, the same way you do a Bath & Body. Just to, just to let y'all know, I compare everything to Bath & Body because you know what you're getting with these, right? There's no guessing in what you're getting with some Bath & Body candles. When it comes down to other brands, you might just have a pool of wax. You just don't know. In comparison, you have 14.5 ounce. You have a three wick. You have a three wick. This is white gardenia from Bath & Body. This is gardenia. As you see, I have one burning here. Check my clips on the side because I time stamp. I burn four hour intervals for a week scrape. And when I tell you, this one is down in the middle and it still has a heavy throw. When you burn your candle too long, when I tell you you mess up the throw, you might go light it one day and you don't smell nothing. This one is like on day seven and I still smell it, you all. Um, honestly, truthfully speaking, I'll never turn my back on Bath & Body Works candles. That's just going to be a no for me because that's just my shit. That's what I like, right? However, 
to lighten the load on my pockets every now and then. Caught this at $14.50, right? Because they had a price increase. Guess what, y'all? Hundreds and homes. $3.99. Dead on dupe. Now, Huntington don't have a lot of scents, but this gardenia scent, I love. I'm a fan. Some people don't like floral scents. I love it. I went, I got one up there burning. I got one right here. I have two more of a different scent um, that smells really, really good. I actually have six of these total at $3.99. I could not resist, y'all. I couldn't resist. And... I got so much other different brands that I have not brought to y'all. I have not shown y'all. But again, like I said, we're going to go through them. And when Bath & Body Works get these new scents, I'm going to review them. I just want y'all to tune in with me and trust me that I got good taste and I won't, I won't steer y'all wrong. You know, whether you like floral scents, food scents, fresh scents, depending on the brand of the candle, that's what we're buying, right? So, soy blend. Soy blend. Soy blend burns better, soy blend burns cleaner. The difference with the Bath and Body Works one I noticed, they're three wick. This is a heavy duty wick. This is the thinner wick, skinnier wick. But it still throws. It still throws. There's some things that when you get into candle use, you're going to know automatically, right? I have some other ones that I'm going to show y'all in another video that you'll be like, oh, okay, I never knew that. Yeah. This one right here, y'all, I just had to bring y'all this little quick little video to show y'all how I unwind and relax with a good wine, um, a good candle, and just get my self-care on in my me time. And if y'all not into candles, start getting into candles. Y'all don't have to spend an arm and a leg like me, but when we got something that's on a deal, something that's budget-friendly, y'all know I'm going to hip y'all to the T, so... Run by y'all all these, get y'all a candle, get y'all a little bit of wine, and relax. And thank y'all for rocking with me. Basketball is on, so I'm going to see y'all on the next. Hey,